What do you think is the main inaccuracy or the main lie that's being told that you feel like you can correct? That the president didn't know what was going on. Uh, president Trump knew exactly what was going on. Uh, he was aware of all of my movements. Uh, he, I wouldn't do anything without the consent of Rudy Giuliani or the president. I have no intent, I have no reason to speak to any of these officials. I mean, they have no reason to speak to me. Why would President Zelensky's inner circle or Minister Avakov or all these people or President Poroshenko meet with me? Who am I? Mm -hmm. They were told to meet with me and uh, that's the secret that they're trying to keep. I was on the ground doing their work. In terms of the president and what he has said about you, um, he said about you and Mr. Fruman, Igor Fruman, I don't know those gentlemen, I don't know about them, I don't know what they do. You're saying that was not a true statement from the president? He lied. I mean, we're not friends. I mean, when you say friends, I mean, me and him didn't watch football games together. We didn't eat hot dogs. But he knew exactly who we were. He knew exactly who I was, especially, because I interacted with him at a lot of events. Mm -hmm. I had a lot of one-on-one -on -one conversations with him at uh, um, gatherings where they would have special, like, these round tables where there would be only six people at a table. We've had several of those. And basically, I mean, I was with Rudy more than, uh, I mean, four or five days out of the week, I mean, and I was in content, con constant contact with him, so. And I was with Rudy when he would speak to the president plenty of times, I mean, so. It's just ludicrous. You've been with Mr. Giuliani when, he was, Giuliani when he was on the phone with the president? Absolutely. And how would you know that he was on the phone with the president? Would it be on speakerphone or you well, could just Well, several times it would be on speakerphone where he would like start the conversation on speakerphone and then take it off and then go somewhere sideways, you know, to talk to him. But a lot of times it would be on the golf course when we were golfing together, especially I remember during the Mueller uh, times where uh, Rudy, I remember, said something that he didn't appreciate or was taken out of context and he was screaming at him. Him so loud. That's why when I watched the impeachment and I saw the testimony about the Sullivan, that I reiter I could understand that uh, you could hear President Trump talking next to, like I heard him several times when he was with Rudy. Because he speaks loudly on the phone. Very loudly, yeah. When you say that the president knew um, about your movements and knew what you were doing, are you saying specifically, and I want to sort of drill down on that, that the president was aware that you and Mr. Giuliani were working on this effort in Ukraine to basically try to hurt Joe Biden's political career. He, was, he knew basically. about that. Yeah, well, it was, it was all about Joe Biden, Hunter Biden, and uh, also Rudy had a personal thing with the Manafort stuff, uh, uh, the Black Ledger. Mm -hmm. and that was another thing uh, that they were looking into, but uh, it was never about uh, corruption. It was never, it was strictly about uh, the Burisma, which included Hunter Biden and Joe Biden. Hey there, I'm Chris Hayes from MSNBC. Thanks for watching MSNBC on YouTube. If you want to keep up to date with the videos we're putting out, you can click subscribe just below me or click over on this list to see lots of other great videos.